He had like a really going. big dick, so I I used mm. to. That's what made me. And sometimes even know that's about hard it. too. When a guy's dick yeah. is too big, it's hard for you to get it. Like it kind of too much. Sometimes it makes you not feel as. You, yeah, you just, I'll cut a nigga off if his dick too big. I did it before. I've done that before yeah. too. Cause yeah. I got, I need this pussy for the rest of I my life. I don't want to be in pain. And I'm not yeah. trying to be fucked up. That makes sense, though, cause I don't want no bot that just got down. Like I could throw throwing a rock. No, and got down but that's different. <laughs> that should be the pain what? that you. Ex- what's up? What's up? It's lip service. I'm Angela Yee. I'm Gigi McGuire. I'm Stephanie Santiago. I'm L'Oreal. On trouble, trouble. <laughs> trouble, trouble. Two yeah, times. Back. Hey, two this time. is the second time you want lip service. Yeah, Welcome back. Hard. You are. Uh, Appreciate y'all having me again. I like chopping up with y'all. <laughs> no, we're glad you're here, cause you got a lot going on right now. You got Something the internet like. going crazy. Crazy. <laughs> With this, uh, is it home. my fault? Yeah, it could be. Absolutely, I you think getting people so. in trouble. My trouble, fault? trouble, trouble, getting people in trouble. Oh, doing that on their own time. So yeah, that's like what I've been trying to figure out. <laughs> is who like how did it start? Like who start? Like they just come challenge. The yes. folks just start doing their own winning. video. <laughs> like you see, I ain't never made no posts in there. Like, hey man, I want y'all got down lick on this cucumber and put my song in the back. You feel me? Like, <laughs> let's, <laughs> let's go up. Yeah, no. Nah. Yeah, like after the song just dropped, like it was going, it was spreading crazy. And then a few girls just sent some video to my to my page. With the song playing. I was like, you going at AWOL. Yeah, with the song, <laughs> yeah, with the song was just playing the back. So did it start with the girl in the car? The one that was twisting it around? It she started like with, uh, girl with the first girl, who, not not the one with the two cucumber. <laughs> no, no, not her. Yeah, I yeah, her yeah. Too, it started with the first girl. She was in the... Okay. Yeah, I so that she put that way. motherfucker up and then Akbar ended up calling him. Akbar V called him. Mm-hmm. We love she her. talking about something. She talking about this bitch thing. She trying to show out on me, truck. <laughs> I think something popping in the street or something. I'm like, what's going on? What's going on? So, well, we got to roll yeah, up. Yeah, man. Yeah, what popping? She talking about some the little skinny bitch who's sucking the cucumber. She talking about, I got that J head. I'm going to show her how to do it. Oh. Oh, shit. Well, take off. <laughs> yeah, before you know it, she was going AWOL in her car. Oh. Then just, and then the rest of the girl just started following from there. Mm. You done started beef and yeah. all kind of stuff behind yeah. that Gosh. cucumber beef. <laughs> yeah, I'm, just, I'm just a spectator. I'm back in the back of, in the background. You breaking up relationships? So, wait, did you, yeah. Yeah. so, you so the challenge? Did you select the winner yet? When uh, is that happening? Nah, I'm gonna do it in like three weeks. I'm gonna, oh, set, I'm gonna okay. set a party up down that motherfucker. Like probably oh, do like okay. a magic pool party type shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then just let like the finalist type shit like just go a while. Live, live at the party. Uh, yeah, more dead. Now yeah, I see some guys. It could be a cucumber, it could be a Johnston. And it's a cash prize, so girls, yeah. y'all can still put your videos. Yeah, they, still, they still got time. They still you still got, got time. time. Now, I know some guys are upset because they don't have a cucumber necessarily. So we might need a different <laughs> challenge. Like okay. a peanut. Like a string bean challenge. String, string bean. bean. <laughs> yeah, a green bean challenge. A green <laughs> bean. Yeah, they, 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 probably, they probably for them thinking they probably just need to grab a carrot or something. <laughs> a carrot. Yeah, yeah, a carrot. A baby then, carrot. Then, baby carrot. Feel little baby like, carrot. Okay. <laughs> Because right. that's not very challenging. You have to admit, like, sucking a small dick is not much of a challenge. No. I know you don't know about that. Yeah, for yeah, I know you don't know, but for us, he's like, 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 what you want me like, to say? No, because that's, like, that's like, like the easiest thing to do. The best thing about sucking a small dick is that you can really show off because mm-hmm. it ain't really yeah, much like, to work look, with. No you hands. go crazy, no <laughs> hand, put every dick up in there, you know, just go crazy. <laughs> Balls and everything. Balls and all. I could imagine that. Slurp it all up. It's probably the easiest in the world to please. Now, we're thinking of some challenges for you guys to participate in because we want to have some fun too. Okay. Right? So we have jerk chicken be? here today so first thing i thought of <laughs> and thank you to jerk shack grill who's in here that bought us some jerk chicken and rice and peas and everything um i thought it'd be good to have a jerk fest right. <laughs> <Pause>. <laughs> <Hold on>. <laughs> <laughs> i ain't gonna <laughs> say what got down you hear me Paul? I'm not, i ain't gonna say what you have in my mind you know what is that no, what, no, no, jerk? what you no, thinking no no y'all what, can't have all the fun you get to see the cute we want to see we want some videos we want y'all to submit some videos to us too but what they gonna be jerking what they gonna be doing yeah. y'all just jerk yourself and put the no video. that's not gonna no, work no, Angela don't listen to Angela don't tell me that in my DMs don't tag me y'all already know I don't want no penis pictures that challenge is going on I don't want no live action penis goddamn videos okay I don't want that you ain't never welcome back to the ground community I'm telling you it yeah. happens in the DM already all the time. It just doesn't but have a name. But what would be something that would be boo for the later though that you a can peach looking post contest? Up. You could eat a peach. It gotta have but like whipped cream and, and you peaches from and cream. You from Atlanta? But anyway. at the same time, it like even like sometimes even if it just look boo. I don't mean like you gonna actually know how to hit this spot or what you doing like when it actually come down to it. Like thousand niggas probably gonna know how to flip their tongue a thousand ways. Yeah. 
I'm just explaining I'm just explaining Ish grad nigga appreciate it though like like who just doing the most out there on the tornado twist with his tongue <laughs> but when it come down to goddamn pleasing his snack he don't know what's happening like that shit ain't him do you think that's the same case for the women that suck in the cucumbers they might not know what they really doing with the dick for, for someone cause how did you learn how to eat pussy experience I mean but, well practice but like the first time, did you kind know? What... know I can't just imagine myself like if it was for me like eating a, a, a peach or whatever See? the fuck like just mm -hmm. trying to show up, show it like it ain't probably ain't gonna look like it him. But it like if we, <laughs> we get one on one and it get the pipe, I know I'm prime time on showing that like cream corn instantly like yeah <laughs> cream corn right. yeah you know that, that cream sound... corn you yeah. know that cream corn you get. <laughs> <laughs> and that Jew get the bumming up out that guy. Fat. I'm so sure. you never thought you was killing it, and the girl was like, "No, no, 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 a little slower," or like, to like the in left. my early day, yeah, like mm -hmm. that, you know, getting fat. Like cause you got <laughs> you got to be attentive, like the, for one, like for her bio reactions, like for for her bio facial expression, all that shit. So mm -hmm. I had to see like because that life is something you could just feel like you just got to pound all the way on out the whole time. That's not it. Right. So there's gonna be certain mm -mm. moments of quarter where you gotta boom, boom, boom. But you can't just be a jack rabbit the whole while. They're gonna right. be like, get your fuck ass up, slow the roll. <laughs> so of course in my early day, like I had to feed that and I was told a couple of times from folk, you feel me? Like, nah, you gotta slow down a little bit, you feel me? Like, ooh. So How that, many folk? <laughs> now I'm saying these was in my early day, cause I'm bet now, you feel me? I'm okay. OG in the down. game. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, so what about the uh, blow a bags challenge? Now, I think this would be a great challenge for guys to participate in. How much money can you spend on your girl? And then y'all could all participate and see I who can spend the most challenge. money. What do y'all think about I that, like challenge? that challenge? I like that challenge. I like it too. I mean, what's that? What's that? I don't like that goddamn challenge. Blow that bag, baby. Yeah. What? <laughs> but what's going to be the like, what, what's the end game What's the end game? To what's that, the end game to this um, she a winner challenge? You they just, just having it. a ball. Yeah, so you guys have ball. a ball. So you have a ball. Yeah. Yeah, they, they, they having a ball with balls out. Yeah, Ballin. they do what they want to do. <laughs> what's the most you ever spent on a, a snack? Uh, it probably been a while. But I don't know, like, I be, it depend on, like, when I'm fucking with her and how I'm fucking with her, for real, for real. Mm -hmm. Like, if we locked in, then it really ain't, I don't even be thinking about it. Ain't really no limit on it type shit. Mm -hmm. But it been a while, like, since I even had something like that, that I'm just fucked with. Just on a daily, like, if we already just rocking, like, like on no relationship shit or none of that shit, but we got to understand, mm -hmm. then, hey, yeah, we can hit the mall or whatever. Like, oh, you need a bag, you need a shoe, and I'll fuck with her campaign. Cause I feel like, it, if I feel like it's going to come back the same way, like, I can hit your jack. Throw it like, ooh, man, you think you can go grab an LV from me, ooh, and she gonna go do it. Right. Then I bet I'm fuck with you. Okay. I think it's been a while because you keep posting these cucumber challenge videos. I'm nah, they like, uh-uh, I don't ain't. want my nigga. Nah, ain't that. They fuck with the Zilla man. Nah, for real, like, nah, that's easy, fam. You feel But nah, it's that, like, for me, it just be about vibe. Like, I ain't just gonna lock in too early type mm -hmm. shit. Like, if I, like, just taking you serious or... Just trust you on no nothing to be like, oh, I ain't fucking with nobody else or that shit. Like, I gotta see how you rock. Like, I gotta find my median too, though. Like, I always check myself. I be looking in the mirror, you feel me? Like, mm -hmm. all right, what the issue is or whatever. Like, for me, like, you might have a snack fine as a dog, like, the finest shit in the planet, you feel? She know how to have fun, she know how to kick it, but she ain't got no hustle. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, be just lazy here, like, broke your foot, don't even be trying no move, you feel? Mm -hmm. And then you might have a motherfucker who hustling and she all right, like, as far as her phys for physical feature, but then she boring it fuck. Mm -hmm. Like, don't never want to go out, don't slide. You ain't got a club hot with a nigga every day type shit or none of that. But sometimes, you know, nigga gonna want to go out, have some fun, turn up, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Jump out your bar, drink, drink if you don't drink, you know what I mean? Hit the dope one time. Mm -hmm. And then you gonna have a motherfucker who just, who might be working, and then they bought the issue, but the features ain't all the way there. Mm -hmm. So you uh -huh. just can't get it all. Yeah, I just... I gotta find out which one I want to sacrifice. <laughs> Damn. I know, Damn. I'm just saying, I'm like, what, I'm just talking about like what level I want to sacrifice to be able to be like, I can like, still fuck with. Okay. I just tried it just recently, right? It like, then when I really knew like what I can't sacrifice, mm -hmm. like the the set got to be a one. Like you ain't got to be a pro, you ain't got to be goddamn pulling her a shouting. Mm -hmm. but, <laughs> but at the same time, like I I gotta be into this shit. Like I was just fucking with a little thug, like like. Ain't last too long, but we were rocking. You feel me? Right. Cause I just ain't want to give out on the too fast. I was like, shit, I'm gonna try it. Maybe she got down to get better. Cause she hustle. She bought her issue, got her own little shots and shit out there, motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Like, she 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 fine. She got down a little eight P. Feel me? Mm -hmm. So she she know how to have fun. She pull up on the block, hit shit with a nigga. Feel me? We can slide out. It was all that. 
But then, like late night when they got down, I gotta come to the crib on turn the on real the on ready to go AWOL. This shit just drives a devil. Oh, like, no. It was beautiful, like. Hey, that's when, when the, you're supposed to eat it. I did that though. Cream I ain't corn. Gonna, I ain't cap it down. I, yeah. I did that. You feel me? So it was like, boom, and that shit'll be a pool for a minute. Then I'll roll, get the roll. Then that shit like, she just dry right back up. Like she got that. You feel me? So I, I still stayed for a be. minute. Like I'm like, man, was maybe she old? Just, I'm gonna just give a little man. Oh, she actually was young. She like, what? She twenty. She probably 24. douching her shit or something. Or she could be on the pill or something like that. Sometimes that'll make you dry. Or she just got a dry pussy and it just ain't gonna work. Then it's just not gonna work. It ain't it. Yeah, I had to tell all gay like y'all. We just can't even. Why do you even use lubricant? You could eat some KY jelly. I'm not jelly. gonna be doing all the extra ass <laughs> shit. I gotta much. go and get an call. I gotta go on the shelf every time we wanna get it. What are we out of town? The shit ain't even got there ready. Like, soon as you get to Puerto Rico, you ready to pop it out soon you get in the room. And oh man, I forgot your juice kit. <laughs> nah, man, this shit need to be ready. Nah, that's a fact. When you stay ready, that's you ain't never got to get it ready. Yeah, so I stayed for a little bit, like over a couple weeks. We tried. Shit, a couple like, weeks. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. How long are you going to stay? Well, I never had nobody with dry pussy. No, nah, I'm, nah, I'm just saying, <laughs> like, the thing is, you rocking with a dude. Like he booed and all that, but he don't know how to please Sex you might be more important to guys than it is to girls, I feel like. Because nah, I've definitely I been agree. in some situations where the sex wasn't amazing. I ain't saying I ain't saying he got to be school. You feel me? I ain't saying he, I, he got to be the top Your of the level. game. But I'm just saying like straight trash. Like he never Have gets. I, a, I've been with somebody who the first time we had sex it was good, and then after that it was not good. I don't know if it was like a, a one off. Like he got lucky that first time. Are you and then drunk? after that I was like I wasn't even drunk. No. The first time I was like oh this was pretty good the first time, and then after that it was whack. And then he probably was on the pier. I've been, with somebody, I've been with somebody whose sex wasn't that great, but since I was so in love with him, mm -hmm. it was like amazing of course. to me. Mm -hmm. you know and guys I mean? know when they're not good and they know their dick isn't good, they'll be like an amazing person and they yeah. won't have sex with you right away. Because they want you to really mm -hmm. agree. Agree. like them. Okay. I agree. Those mm -hmm. be the ones you got to watch out for when they take too long. Yeah, I, when like, a guy I know wants it was to a wait, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a sus. I knew you was high. So how do you stay throughout that process? How did you follow like in love, like using all of With in somebody, love. okay. But he went in right. She the whole cheated. You no. cheating. <laughs> I did. I did. <laughs> but, <laughs> but. Because the thing with him was that he just, he didn't have a big dick. I know I could have said string. that a he different a way. Bean. He had a little dick and he used to eat pussy good. So mm. he would always eat my pussy every time we would have sex. Right. And yeah. I'm not even the kind of girl that needs to get my pussy ate every time. I like to get, I well, like dick. Right. I'm, you know, I'm dick. very, I'm a very, you know, straight girl. So I like dick, but you know, like all of that and then being in love, like it didn't even matter that his dick was small. Like it was just like, okay, I don't feel it, but it's okay. Fuck right. it, I'm gonna just go with it. Then got now. I know I but got Tyrone I, when it's but, time. But like you said, <laughs> yeah, the yeah, question yeah, yeah. you asked was how did it get there? But um, how did it get for me to be in love with somebody whose sex is bad, right? Fair. But um is that I knew him for a long time and um, we hung out for like right. a while you had to before love him we even first. had sex. Mm -hmm. yeah. See, y'all already, y'all really, already, see, that really cheat code. Y'all already had a born type shit. It's really like, I'm already just rocking right. with dog. Right. But I'm saying like, you just met then and you feel me? You mm -hmm. was scrolling in the mall, rally, pushed up on your campaign. You were smelling what he was selling. You feel me? He was picking up what you were putting <laughs> down. You feel me? And then y'all kicking the one out that then when it came time for it, you like, yeah, nah, they, what the fuck it did? What are you doing, my man? I had a listen. That's I told Laurie this too because remember you had sex with somebody that was whack the first the first time. It was yeah. so whack, and, and I, I was like, I'm done. Mm -hmm. And I was like, it might have just been whack because y'all not in sync. Because sometimes it take a little while to get in sync. Like the first time you have sex with somebody, y'all might be in two different. Like he don't really know what you like, you don't know what he likes. Yeah. So sometimes it don't gel right away. Yeah, it didn't gel at all. And I was like, not with it. She actually got him a second chance. She's like, why don't you just give him another chance? Because I said, you already fucked him once. Yeah, the yeah. first time. It's not, yeah. It didn't work. <laughs> it was all right. It was better the second time, but it still wasn't never great. You know what I mean? I feel like if I would have just left after the first time, yeah. I would have been cool. But it's then you really been, liked him. That's what happened. I liked him. That's what he fucked up. He fucked me up. It be dudes up. with whack dick and then you end up liking him. And yeah. You be mad at yourself. Stupid it's terrible when, I like, like him. When you don't, it's terrible too though. Like when you don't got that suffice on now level. Like the socks terrible too. Because that was my issue. Like it was like the bottom was trash and then the socks was ass. Like she couldn't blow my socks out. Like I don't care if I had on some footage. Like she couldn't do it. I'm like I just remember seeing right there like. <laughs> 
<laughs> but she can cook real good too. Oh, so I might be like, well, don't, don't even Damn, worry about it. Like, you got to cook. cook. She like make some pork chop real quick. Yeah. <laughs> she just go make. She probably gonna listen to you. Just gotta use it for what she good for. I ain't gonna, I ain't no told on nobody in history though. Like, so I ain't gonna say no names. She knows she is though. I know what I'm saying. She probably gonna see that the pork chop. She was like, "Damn, that's my dad." That was me. That was he. And just when I thought he loved my pork chop, he really hate my head. But question, ladies. All right, this might help trouble out a little bit. Have you ever been with a guy that just couldn't get your pussy wet, even though other guys can? I've been with a guy who um, we would go into sex real fast, so it wouldn't give it a chance to mm. get wet. You need you to know? get warmed up. So he, we would, he would like have to like mix it around, and then it'll get wet. You know, like my body's like, oh, 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 we're getting sex. Right. You know what I mean? But... What I used to do is, because sometimes that's kind of painful and kind of trash. I hate I hate that. There's like these suppository lubricants you could use inside. You know, G, I've told you about it before, right? What's it called? It's there's, They got a whole bunch of them. There's a whole bunch of different you brands. What the fuck is it? And, and <laughs> you, about to buy that bitch. I'm not buying shit. I'm not going to go down. No, but that's, that's not Chico. She needed that. She needed that. She she needed needed that. Yeah. It's Chico. And they, um, they have <laughs> one, the one that I like. At the time, because I, I haven't had to use it in a while, I, like a good two years, I haven't had to use it. But Vagisil has one, and it feels just like your same fluids. Mm -hmm. And it's like a little, you put it in, and you're already wet. You're ready to go. Right. So you, he didn't know you would put it in? No, he didn't know. Okay. He didn't know. But there was a, another brand that he he figured it out because he was eating my pussy one time oh, and he could shit. taste it. But it tasted real it sweet. Like he was like, was what is it? it? He was like, what is this? What, yeah. is, what did you put in there? And I'm like, nothing. What are you talking right. about? And he's like, what is it? What is it? What is it? You should have told him that you could eat a sour patch kids all day. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. See, I wouldn't even want to have to have my female like doing all that. Though. Like, wow. I don't know. I feel like she got to go high and juice kids and shit like that. Yeah, I yeah, like yeah. You know what that gonna do to a man coming in? He just go wait, cleaning up the spot or something while you at work. Then got that yeah, you got the draw. He got the whole oh, juice kit. Nah, and oh, his dick. He had like a really, he had like a really stone. big dick. So I, I used mm. to. That's what made me. And sometimes even know that's about hard it. too. When a guy's dick yeah. is too big, it's hard for you to get it. Like it kind of too much. Sometimes it makes you not feel as. You, yeah, you just, I'll cut a nigga off if his dick too big. I did it before. Mm. I've done that before yeah. too. Cause yeah. I got, I need this pussy for the rest of I my life. I don't want to be in pain. And I'm not yeah. trying to be fucked up. That makes sense though, cause I don't want no bot that just got down. Like I could throw, throw on a rock no. and got down. Well, that's different. Sex <laughs> should be the pain well, I, that you experience with sex should be pleasurable still. Right. Like it mm -hmm. shouldn't just hurt. It should like hurt good. Yeah. So if it like hurt, like I'm good on you. Like you keep. But it's a way to do it too though. Like you ain't just, I ain't just got to still crush you. Like, <laughs> right. Never, like put the whole no, thing in that guy's face. He wouldn't like ram me. He would like mix it around. You know, like yeah. Find you it. Play with that guy a little bit. It. I mean, spit on that motherfucker then. <laughs> Put that yes. cucumber on the I tip of that guy, scroll yes, around that yes. kid, you feel me? Yeah, I never had that problem. Scroll with, across. Like, I never used lube. I never, like, I something with my body as soon as you touch. Now, what has happened to me was, like, I've been very, very wet, and then the dude has been very, very boring. And then, mm -hmm. I mean, after a while, I'm like, all right, now this is starting to feel not so wet anymore. Right. But it's mm -hmm. never dry mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's like he's not doing anything or whatever. You like, know what no, and it be yeah. your mind that makes you dry up. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, this guy's yeah. wet. Yeah, it could also like, be your mind that make you wet, too. Yeah. You know what else? When you dry up after you come. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then it's it like, okay, I'm wet. done. And then it get dry. If See, for a man, that's why you got to know when that happening, too, though. Because mm -hmm. right out of the couch, that when you go ahead and eat your cream corn. <laughs> yeah, man, after that guy start locking up a little bit, boom, it's time to pull on up out of there. Pew. <laughs> He's Yo, his demonstration of eating yeah. pussy be so funny. That's gonna be the challenge. Right there, you go. Man. Right, there you go. <laughs> All right, cream now. corn challenge. Let's go. <laughs> hey, corn. We gonna See. play a little game. What type of game we playing? It's um, name that ex. Now you don't have to name her name, but we mm. need the situation. All right, so name an ex who can still get it. I'm a name, but don't say a name. But give the situation. Like this chick that I had that mm -hmm. she X, Y, Z. She gonna know who she is. She used to make X. pork chops, so she uh, can't get it no more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. X? <laughs> yeah, okay. He ain't now one of them, baby. It ain't gotta be it. still get it? Huh? I'm thinking like, that's hard, cause I ain't thought about now one of them motherfuckers, <laughs> truthfully. <laughs> and what? And I take that back. But I wouldn't really say like, <laughs> we went like really like going together. It was a thing. 
mm-hmm. but we went, but because she was married. Mm. Let's snack out talking about. So the like, one that had the apartment with you? Facts. That motherfucker <laughs> up. That shit stick with me to this day. <laughs> to this yeah, day. <laughs> to this day. <laughs> to this day. So she could yeah, get it right now. Facts. She yeah, still married? Yeah. Husband and all. Yeah, they still out there. Mm. Damn. <laughs> he uh, don't they, know? They supposed to thank me for that. Nah, he knew. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He ended up finding that. Damn. He cool with you though? He still listening nah, to music? Nah, we, we were never, no, we were never still cool. And he old. Like, you feel right. like. So like, but she, he ended up finding out or whatever. Like, okay. it's bull. He kick out really, every time he stayed song, with her. On. He should have reached out though and thanked me though. Cause the only reason that kept going, she was ready to tap. <laughs> yeah, 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 she was ready to tap out for you and you yeah, like, and I'll stay where you at. I can't right. do that though. You if helped I, her if relationship. I stole you from Buddy, then what's what gonna the happen to me? Gonna do to me? How right. you get him is how you keep him. Hell no, like we can keep rocking. Did you want to be with her or did you like the situation? Like no, nah, I fought with Shadow. Mm-hmm. Like I could see myself with Shadow, but at the same time, like one thing played on my mind is that for how I almost basically stole her from him. Mm-hmm. So it's like, all right, shit, that can easily handle me, goddamn. For how vicious she got at me, like the way she did it, mm-hmm. I was like, she three hard. I was like, women got that. I was like, nigga would have never even thought about this. The way that girl sent me her number, like she put like the number on different Instagram pictures in a row. And I just end up being checking my page. And when I did, I was going down. I was like, what the fuck is all these numbers? What in the and then I, I went back codes? up and I and put it seven, in a row like, ten damn, numbers. four, four, two, you feel me? All of that, I she might as well have just wrote the number. Why she just ain't send you a That was hard. But you got to think about it. She a married woman. So like nigga probably got down might be checking them DMs or something. And then he see all them numbers. I'm about to say because when you comment, <laughs> you go to the other side you and it says picture. such and such comment. You might be able to he... be like you just rating the pictures or something. Somebody so she didn't do it back, back to back number. to back. She did it randomly. She did them on different pictures. You also said the husband was old, so he ain't gonna figure that out with his old ass. Like she let I don't me go. know that nigga was Inspector Gadget. He found out a lot. That nigga found out a lot of shit. Damn. But outside of that, like me thinking about somebody else being able to get down and get up, I'm making my girl ring. One of my old head got down, he knew a hood. Mm. So he one of the one that was in my ear, like, man, let the man have his white truck. Like, ooh. Damn. Let the man, the man have his have wife. Why? Yeah, yeah, yeah. so Did she like, still man, be reaching out but to you? I ain't, like, I ain't do that though. You feel me? I ain't, you the I ain't go out my way. Yeah, I ain't go out my way though. They was the home. Like, I ain't get at you. It was like, it wasn't like I was knowingly knowing you, like, you married and shit. You feel he me? Figured and then, like, out fuck the clues. That she, she sent them. On paper but you trail. did. You did it. She though. Like, did it. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Do she okay. still be reaching out to you though? <laughs> nah, I had a little buddy the other day. Told me she we chopped about it, chopped it up and shit. Okay. I mean, so it's still the same thing. A little. We just got to keep that. I'm over here. You over there? What if she gets a divorce? I ain't nah. I can't. I probably still. I say, I'm. A, I'm a jumping that shit. He Would said you wife she could still yeah, get yeah, like you still get it. I yeah. jump, man. But could you I went, imagine? I went staying, try to build nothing up with you. Could you imagine mm-hmm. staying with somebody after that? Like with a with a woman. What you mean? After she done cheated and was all up on the next dude, you think you can stay with her? Hell, fuck no, not me. Mm-hmm. Now we stay boo. Like then they like I, don't, I ain't tight nigga. Like I don't be holding no grudges or none of that shit. Like shit happening in life, you feel me? Mm-hmm. And I know that much. Like, I don't, I don't been through all of it. So it's like at the end of the day, like we can have a type of friendship where it's like all right, we can slide out together or whatever, kicking in the club, you know what I'm saying? We can go get something to eat, whatever. But I ain't gonna be trying to goddamn have no, no real relations with you. You ever went through a girl's stuff? Like went through her phone? Nope. Went through anything in her house? Went through the drawer to see what's in the drawer? See if there's some... No. I feel like that's invading the private. And I, I always be trying to put out the same energy that. Like what I want in return, <laughs> like, like that's what I put out. So they're like, I don't, I don't be wanting that shit to come back to me. Like I'm going through all your shit on sneak ass shit. You know, I feel like a lot of women going to do that anyway. Especially like once they fucking with a nigga mm-hmm. and you locked in. It's like, hell nah, a motherfucker bit me want to make sure like... Be assured of that shit. Like, hell nah, make sure I'm the only one type shit. And I get that. It's female. Y'all got them curiosity. Y'all would kill the cat. Y'all the kitty cats. So <laughs> I like, feel like all guys do that. They try to act like they, they don't. That's on God. That's on right. God, though. I okay, maybe you this. haven't, but you know a lot of guys, lot of guys, do, guys that. do Oh, yeah, most definitely. How about like the car seat? I feel like that's one thing that a guy will do. Like, he'll get in the front seat and be like trying to see... If the seat's back far, like as if a guy was sitting there. Oh, no, nah, that, that normal shit. Hell yeah, yeah. I don't mm-hmm. been on that one all, time, all day, you feel me? Because you gonna, it's going to always be in your mind. Like, especially if you don't been in no tight situation where folk don't fuck around on you mm-hmm. or or don't fuck around on they folks to fuck with you. Mm-hmm. And there's certain shit that you do the way you catch it. Like, hell yeah, no. Nah. So I'll get, if I'm hopping in, you pulling up on me and I'm knowing, like, for one, you be by yourself, and if you ain't got them, you got some homegirl with you. I ain't know they ain't sent back fat Matt got them. <laughs> so if I get any motherfucking shit. on lean cuisine, <laughs> yeah, man. Hey, nah, been, oh, oh, no, man, huh? What block you been on? I'm nothing up. What block you done been on? I'm nothing up. We gotta get to the bottom of it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, name an ex who you did her dirty, but and you feel bad about it, and you want to apologize. 
She ain't deserve it. Uh, ex or just somebody I was fucking with? Somebody, Clearly, you, know, you somebody have no exes. Fucking with. Like, not a, a plethora of them. Somebody to go you through, did so. Dirty. We just gonna make it One somebody. Girl, and tell, it, just tell uh, the situation. Yeah. First, right. thing just, first thing just came to my mind. I was rocking with her though. But it was like, uh, we were locked in here. Like, she basically got down, before we even got a spot together, like, she was, she was staying with me, basically, I was staying with her. And then we got our own shit just together. So we were rocking out here. And then got down, but her buddies I always be over at the spot. Mm-hmm. Like two of her got down close friend. They didn't know her since she was like, they oh, were like eight years old. We know yeah. where this is headed. I don't know if y'all knew this, like, but I decided. I got him as soon as he said two so, of her buddies. So, so gang, like, gang. so even when I, like, I come through late night or whatever, like we smoke with them, DJ just chopping shit. Then mm-hmm. we go through the back, and on we doing we doing that motherfucker. I'm in here jump man. You feel me? Jump man daughter. That when you jumping in another man daughter. So I'm jump man daughter, <laughs> kill him. But a buddy them be in the living room. So it just got to one point. One on end up reaching out to me like. So we linked up. She was like, True, got down. She what well, she expect. She told us, We been here with y'all in there doing this shit. She don't think a bitch supposed to got down or some of that. Like, so it's her I fault. ain't got nobody who no. then go it. But after this, that one she this say, is, like, this is what bitch, I'm she, you ain't the only one got down. Oh, uh, she be fucking with none of that shit. No way. Damn. So hey, she straight squirrel out. I was like, oh, I power the conversation. Like, what you just said again? You like, yeah. like, yeah. hell nah, yeah. like that bitch trying, like, ooh, like I ain't even gonna let you guys say it like that. But at the same time, I ain't thinking like she just trying to. Get at me or right, weasel, right, weasel right. a butt out and all that shit. Y'all been rocking since I was eight years old. You feel That's me? So fucked up. I ended up going for it. I ain't go for it immediately. I just took E to it and it was like, but but y'all done end up staying on my goddamn line. We linked one day, boom. I ended up goddamn killing her. <laughs> and then, but it was just on me so bad because I fucked with y'all. I ended up goddamn straight squirreling out like while we chopping one day. Because we had to understand that like y'all don't ask you face to face when we talking. Just always just keep it gangster with me no matter what it is. Mm-hmm. I'm always respected if it coming from you first. Like versus somebody else having to come tell me some shit, you feel me? And I'm gonna do the same for you. So it was like when we were chopping one day, I straight end up there telling like while we were chopping like, man, I end up tearing your butt up. But it came from her telling me you got down, you out here spreading my box. But wow. at the same time, like shit, I'm you feel me. So I always had them regretted that shot. Like, man, I should've never did though. Like that. Are they me? still friends with each other? Nah, hell nah. She pulled up to one of her party, whooped her at the club, got them at her house, all type oh shit. My her pull up game strong. She was throwing like <laughs> that's that's a strong pull up game. Yeah, yeah, she went. <laughs> she, she went she, got that job at yeah, house. Yeah, man, she went AWOL about that shit. <laughs> I was like, damn. So I, put, I crashed their whole relationship. Did you feel bad like, after that you like ruined their relationship too? Yeah, hell yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like that shit, I was like, man, I shouldn't. But she did, ruined their relationship. Yeah, she did ruin their relationship. She did. That's not, her real friend. that's not her real friend. He, they both played their part. Yeah, but that's supposed saying. to be your friend from when you were eight. Right, but Where I'm not sure how did he feel about his right. part. And then not, of course, who knows what the girl He might have did her favor because you don't need a girl like that around that's you. Right. Clearly. Sure. Truthfully. That guy, yeah. That yeah, I don't want right nobody like that around me that's going to tell on me mm-hmm. and right. fuck my and man. And fuck my yeah. man. Yeah. But mm-hmm. okay, just after the fact, though, just like in my own mind, I was like, Man, I should kind of know what their relationship was. I was like, I still could have just been like, fuck, shout out, and then like, fuck you too. And then going about my way. Mm. But for me, it was like at that point where I was at, it was like, Shh, fuck that kill too then. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you spread That's my what box. Wanted. Knock your buddy <laughs> down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ever had a guy tell on you? Like tell one of your snacks that you was Oh, all the time. That always happened. Like the and they be jumping the gun. Like we might not even be locked in like that. Mm-hmm. Like we might just be vibing, ain't you know no relationship shit, then a nigga got down. But they always come tell a nigga like at the same time, like that would he like that nigga don't even be getting like they be spraying you really piping me up my boy. Like, <laughs> oh man, right. you used to fuck with such such. Ooh man, you don't need don't need like that man. Ooh, Jack he ain't had nothing but a cup girl. Mm. So boom, so the hook she will come straight to me all the time like they always do. Is it ever somebody you thought you was cool with? Yeah, hell yeah, yeah. That shit one one situation was so crazy. It ended up being a nigga who was too close to me. Like the bit end up recording the nigga like. Putting a voice Whoa. memo on, like while they were talking at the spot. Wow! So you heard it, like uh, just hearing it from somebody. Somebody just right. telling me, I wouldn't even believe that. Like, like heard I want to wait for. I don't go fuck who told me. Like, man, I ain't going for that. They my dog, feel me? But the girl <gasps> ended up telling me the whole situation and then played it on the voice memo. And I hear the nigga help pouring salt like Damn, a bitch. That's crazy. Like, wow. He still don't even know. Like I just cut the fuck nigga on no. Like it was like I don't want to do nothing to you. No, it was like I just cut him off. He still don't know to the day. Like why we cut it off until he probably hear the interview and then gonna figure it out. Like damn. Damn, what but you is. see the difference between guys and women. She it's like she up went pulled up and whooped her ass, and he just was like, you know what? I'm gonna just cut him off. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's yeah. weird to me how right. the difference is. Right. Yeah, that's a different type of. It was a different situation though. Mm. 
Cause with me, yeah, it was just like her home girl. Yeah. yeah, but the friends and you told him he might have felt like he wasn't even worth it. Like maybe that did. Yeah, yeah. Like, like well, I'm like well, I'm like fuck, I'm gonna get out of this shit. And they're like, like you a duck for one. Like you mm-hmm. lying to even being like I ain't never talking about no another nigga. Like when I'm with female. Like we just be enjoying time so bad and enjoying life, like he ain't even no time for that. Right. You remember like so I'm never thinking about or talking about no another man ever in history. So it, like for me, for one, like that's across our gate. Like why you if you all already locked in, y'all somewhere where y'all in private, got down time and y'all one on one or even if other girl there or whatever the fuck. Mm-hmm. Why are you even talking about me, period? Right. And then if you is talking about me, how'd you point us out? And you're supposed mm. to be a nigga dog. And that looks so lame to like, women, just so y'all guys know out there, mm-hmm. that's lame when you talk to Oh my to God, it's lame. so lame. You be like, okay, you really jealous. You ever had a guy ask you about another guy? Like, so mm-hmm. y'all was fucking around? So what, ha- like, ask you questions? And I, like, I, I went, I had a time with one guy and he wanted to know every single person that I knew in the industry that I might have went on a date with, whether we had sex or not. He wanted to know every. He wanted to name names. He was like, "Oh, you was with this one, you was with that one." That's and bodies on me that I never even knew. I'm like, I don't even know that guy. Mm-hmm. And he's like, "Oh, you're with this one." And we had like a whole fucking. We had a whole argument about it. Nah, that's so, dope because shit. I felt like it was so whack. Annoying. I thing. felt like it was so whack. Like I don't care who you slept with. You be, you've been with so many girls in the industry. Every fucking thought about around the corner. Yeah. And it's none of my business. Mm-hmm. And you over here. Trying to put bodies on me I and even forcing me to, to tell you games. the truth, like forcing me to yo, really like, give him the real body. Relaying, That's kind. relaying to that situation, yo, that that line the hell though. Like I ain't gonna never like name for name, but it's like y'all would me, die if with, I told you. With who me, it was. it's like bro, it's like for me, <laughs> yeah. I don't, for me, I don't, me right. personally, just speaking for trouble, I don't get no fuck. Mm-hmm. Like real nigga shit, like I don't care how long the list here though. Like I already feel like in my mind, like. Everybody got a history. Mm-hmm. Right. Like we, only, we had to live it out there, motherfucker. At some point in time, ain't nobody just out there, motherfucker. Ain't no saints running around this bit, period. Mm-hmm. Like in my mind, like everybody done did what they done did. You right. know what I mean? I don't give a fuck what the county is. So for me, like anytime I'm taking somebody serious and they're like we pushing it to a level to where we really trying to build something, only thing I always ever end up telling you is like if it's somebody around in the circle or somebody you know I'm fucking with. Right. Right. Give me that. Give me the benefit of that. Doubt. Like, let me know. Like, like, pull me you. to the side, like, throw up, man. Yes, Shout yes. out down. Woo, woo, woo. You, playing. you ain't got to go into detail, none mm-hmm. of that shit. Like, I just wanted to let you know. You feel me? Because I want to be able to have that respect and be able to right. have, still have my faith value if a lame ass nigga come and try to tell <laughs> right. me before yes. you do. And when you're starting Funny. somebody with something with somebody, you should have the confidence that if you are in the room or if they are friends with somebody, you should be able to tell them like, hey, this happened. Right. You exactly. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And like, you can't give somebody your whole roster. You can't sit with somebody and give them your whole roster. You know what I mean? Yeah, fact. Like, that sounds nah, that crazy. You're making shit. yourself, okay, you're but, making yourself yeah. look like a rat. Yeah, and you're shit. making yourself just look What dumb. if a girl did want to know and you was taking her seriously and she was like, I don't want to know anything. I'm just I'm asking him if no she did counsel, say, like, I, I just I don't, need to know no. who you been I don't with. I'm going to be on that. Like, I'm going to want it the same. I'm going to respect it the same way that I want it to be done. Like, I'm not finna goddamn be named and every goddamn body on the planet. You, you about to like, get some people too. On, Damn, yeah. on the planet, Trump? Nah. No. <laughs> you said it. No, nah, but I ain't got nothing. But I'm not finna be going name for name and all that shit by motherfucker. Like, if it's somebody you fuck with right. or any you know of that shit, you feel me? Like, I might. Because sometimes, I don't know, it be, it be back and forth. I don't have a situation where, like, you you don't ask me about a buddy and I don't been like, Man, you all at her or something. Like, I don't know nothing about that, all that. Right, because like, you don't want to be a rat. Cause, like, I ain't been a rat or I, Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, it done also been a couple instances where I was like, man, I might not go into detail, but I just be like, man, we we got that house and dealing. Like, I was fucking with her. Right. You feel me? So I just let it be known like that. Then however you take it out to that fact, it's cool. And, but I can't just be name and name like every single fucking name. I don't met some weirdo like that too. And honestly, like, I don't know no, why you would want to know. No, I need you, you to tell know. me every person. Mm-hmm. Why? You, I need you to lose my number. <laughs> I don't want to know. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, don't have to lose yeah, my yeah. number. Oh, you get by Ryan. No, and yeah. I just don't understand why. For me, I don't want to know anybody you slept with. Anybody because really? I think I am fire. I think like I think my pussy's <laughs> the best pussy. I feel like my shit is fire. Like I am that bitch in my mind. What if I fucked him? You and, so know? anybody. Yeah, you you need to you know, know your friends. I, Any, feel like, I know if it's my yeah, friend, a friend, then you should know. <laughs> that yeah. I'm not, not fucking, fucking with you either way. <laughs> but like an but, associate, I don't give a like, fuck. But like when I start finding out who you fucked with, I'm like, ew, oh my god, really that? Mm. But her, why? But what if the nigga so it ain't turns even, me off. What if the nigga ain't even know like there was like say for instance like the nigga had done had a dealing with one of your buddies before? No, no. If even, it's somebody that I know, you should tell me. 
I'm just I saying, but know. I ain't even know that with your butt or none of that shit mm. before I met you, none of that shit. Like, me and Shadow fought around a couple times. And it just times, happened. Yeah. Just and then we ended Honestly, up Honestly, I don't even want to know. If she didn't tell me and you didn't tell me, as, yeah. as long as we not around each other, we can't get it. It's none of my business. I what you did before me is none of my business. Please right. don't tell me anything, God. Because <laughs> it ruins everything. And then when we argue, I'll be like, oh, you don't go back to that what dump if, but truck. But what I'm saying here, though, like, everything bitch. always come out of the closet at some point in time. Yeah, you can't hide this shit, though. You can't yeah, build no skeletons I mean, up. What needs to be said, you say yeah. it. But if it don't need to be said, leave me alone. Sometimes you wait too long. To tell somebody too, yeah, you then be like, you be like, fuck it, I ain't telling. <laughs> Missed opportunity. Is it too late? <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like when you get to that point, though, that would even like make you feel more fucked over, though. Yeah, true. Yeah, like you, know you should have been like, so. Yeah, yeah, like the fuck. Like so we've been rocking three years, and you've been saying you so long. I'm all around a nigga ass, and this shit just hit me. Like, yeah, you get like about all the instances y'all yeah. with the building and everything. Like, like what? You just said the yeah. <laughs> so wait, so you would feel okay if she came to you after three years and was like, "This man no, eating I'm me out." make it worse. Yeah, yeah but she came worse. to like, you. Versus you just keep it with gangsta with me early in the day. After three years, you might as like, well have kept you that to yourself. You had something for this long. <laughs> right. Oh my. Clutching like your pearl. Yeah, yeah, like, <laughs> oh my. Oh, you good? Yeah, but like you fine. I ain't know what the trip from what you talking about. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's why. Because that's what happens sometimes. You wait too long and you like, I didn't tell him yeah. when I had the opportunity. They didn't be hanging. Yeah, and yeah, then you just I let ain't it say go. Nothing. Yeah, you just, and then every, you get caught in a worse way. Yeah. Yeah. Same time, everybody different too though. Like, so you gotta really like know who you're dealing with. Cause some people can respect that. Like if you just keep a with them and then some folk like it just ruin their whole parade. Mm -hmm, if mm -hmm. you just by you just telling them the truth. Yeah, because you look at somebody different when they fuck with somebody who you think is whack. No, that's what I'm saying. And, yeah. And you'd be like, yeah. and like, like if you was with a chick and she was like, me. oh yeah, I fucked da, da da And you like, damn, he lame as hell. Man, Maybe that I shit just happened to me recently on Lord <laughs> exactly. himself. Yeah. Like, how you gonna feel, girl? You like, lame just nigga messing alone, with a lame, man. exactly. Yeah, yeah, but I couldn't even keep going into it, kid. Like, I don't like talking about no nigga. So it was like, right. y'all just got to bring it up one instant who she was fucking with or whatever. My whole response, I just... Oh my God! <laughs> yeah. She said, "All oh, my friends say the same thing." I said, "I'm not finna say nothing." Shout that Joe about me respond. That just how I felt, but right. I can't believe. Now you like, right? Hey, yeah, yeah. Like, how did you even like? How did we even start fucking with me? Like, you feel like I'm too big. How did you get me? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, us women feel like that all the time. All the time. When we get with somebody and we see what they used to fuck with, we be like, how? Ew. No, and it's right. a turn off. That's how why can you even be know. attracted to me if you're attracted to that? That's like how I not know. You ain't got no type. Because you have no standards. Some, you have bad taste before me, baby. Yeah, right. man. That shit make me look at you sideways. And look. I don't want nothing to do with All right, that. name an ex who had you pussy whip. <laughs> Crickets. It was all about that pussy. Mm -hmm. Nobody? You ain't never been pussy whip? You ain't never been going all out your way just to get the pussy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm talking about Jimmy the Crick. Yeah. Jimmy. Nothing comes to mind. Yeah, no, nah, nothing comes to mind. Cause no. I don't know. I just, I don't know. Like you never hopped on a flight to get some pussy. Never. No, I don't brought some food out of town, but I ain't never just went out my way for like that shit. Like I don't know. Like, <laughs> aunt, like, un, like I'm just so confident for real, for real. Like I just know I'm fat. So it like I I make that that like so it like I ain't really had nobody or met nobody the way it was like. She just extra showed out on me, like, like Never, ever, you just ever. did your damn thing. Nothing comes to mind. Not even like not an ex or a relationship. I don't have but... some folk fire cool, like like damn, like, she don't know what she's doing. <laughs> but it was like, <laughs> she knows what she's doing. Yeah, but it was like ain't ain't no instant where it just been like. Like you leave I'm the studio every time shit, you like, leave the yeah, studio, like, I'm coming there. Like I'm cursed. I got to see you. I got to be there. Like where you at? Like blowing your line up type shit and shit. Like so, I ain't never had. So that. currently at this moment, out of. Whatever you doing that you in your life, you don't have no favorite. Like who's your favorite? You got a favorite right now? A favorite? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nah, they probably all on the same boat. Oh <laughs> no, the one that's thinking. I would hate to be on that boat. <laughs> Crowded ass boat. I need to be. The, I need to be driving. Yeah, I need to be the captain of the boat. All right? If I'm on the boat, I need the top motherfucking tier <laughs> of the boat. I be boat, speaking right? about that shit though, like in my captain and that, shit. I and need, when I make I need to drive the shit, like, fuck a boat. Okay? I be. I'm waiting on my day, like to meet one of the motherfuckers like who's showing out, like you feel me, like a show out, like. Oh man, she the one. You feel me? Like, she a winner. I, yeah, I get tired of seeing all the other niggas and shit. Got damn like shit in and shit. I be like, real shit. I be like, man, and especially you with, think with them guys niggas are settling? The hell, you think I they be, settling? How the hell he get there? They locking in like that. You think they settling? They doing they what? Settling. Settling. Mm -hmm. Like who? The nigga or the, or the, the guys? Are they settling with certain snack? 
I don't know for sure. I can't really say that though. Like, it's just a uh, feeling. I, think it, I yeah. honestly think a lot of females be out here settling. Yeah, I think. Now, so when it comes to female, yeah, of course, you know, you know that they be bad out here talk. Settling for whatever. Mm-hmm. So, like, certain like, certain, 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 certain lonely, bitches ain't gonna yeah. give a fuck. Like, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? For off a nigga, I can't really say they settling it because they just be them type of duck. They don't even like nigga D Day. They don't really give a fuck what oh bring it to the table. What she got going on? Mm-hmm. It's just like if you a look, like if you popping or goddamn you fine here and everybody like damn how you catch those type shit. That what these nigga want. Yeah. Uh, like, and they just gonna cuff it up, move you in, buy you whatever the fuck, and you might not have no type of vibe together. It's like, and that's why they always end up in a situation where they end up seeing they snatch somewhere else or mm-hmm. with the school or something like <laughs> having a ball, like <laughs> we having a ball over here. But when she with him, it's like she looking miserable as fuck. But like <laughs> I stop, like he just bought her everything. She got the pee on, you feel me? Like she laced up, got the new still motherfucker, <laughs> him and big bag. Nigga, <laughs> big him bag. Him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think that's a form of settling because I feel like they only doing it for the clout. Like the fact that the girl might be popping and they like, oh, well, fuck it. Good. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's a good look but for like me. But like settling to me is like when you like, when you know, like when yeah. you know better. When you know you could do better, like but you, you just like, fuck it, I'm tired. Like, that's what they call it, settle, settle like, down. That's yeah. exactly. You know, what I'm saying? You know you can like yes. someone better. Like that when you can do you know something you can better. Do better mm-hmm. but like, you so for niggas, like, so a nigga don't give a fuck about it being no better. It's just about you being a look. But you know what? A lot of guys won't. Be with somebody because they always are looking for something better. Like they mm. think there might be something better out there, even mm-hmm. if there's not. And a guy, I feel like for a lot of guys in your head, it, it's like, I feel like I could do better. You be feeling like that sometimes? Like you like? No, for me, it just it's, it go back to them three angles that I was just talking about. Like mm-hmm. I just gotta find a medium the way it's like. You haven't found nobody like that that has yeah, everything. Nah. Like like I said, like if it, mm-hmm. like for instance, like last shot I just brought up, if a bottom. Was just even all right. Like her bottom was all right, mm-hmm. top was good, and she got down. She couldn't cook, or she could cook, and she was just on her way, like grinding. Like she went at the top, she ain't had no throws, none of that shit. I can deal with that type of shit. Mm-hmm. Like for me, like my my snack, like you ain't got to be all the way up through the moon. You ain't got to be rich or even halfway there. It's just about trying something. Like mm-hmm. just be doing Try. something. Hell yeah, yeah, I preach right. that shit all day. Like I don't give a fuck what you working on, but you can still got down. You can got down be juggling from. Uh, a cubicle to got down waffle how late night, you know what I mean? Flipping them in at the real store, whatever the fuck. Just truth be told with me. I don't, I'm just talking about me. I don't give a fuck. As long as you trying something, just don't be sitting on your ass. Like, right. I don't want no fine and broke ass who, like, who ain't doing nothing. Like, <laughs> that shit don't you. do it for me. I wouldn't want to be. So for me, I just I know I can't, I can't, broke I can't man. sacrifice the six. Like, you feel me? Like, I can't sacrifice that though. Like, cause they're like, they're like my thing. Like, I'm Scorpio. You feel me? Like, the true one. Like, like true to it, like oh lord, like, like to the Scorpio's core. Scorpio's nasty. Yeah, my worst boyfriend was a Scorpio. To the <laughs> Your core. worst, like, so just I, he was the worst. I can't give up that part. Like yeah, like you gonna have to be all right. Like so, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Scorpios have an insatiable sexual appetite. Yes, they do, mm-hmm. and they will so lie their ass off. To to the get, oh, no, they no. will lie, lie, lie. <laughs> anyway, mm-hmm. um. Sounds now, like a lot of men. I know you got a lot of things going on. <laughs> <laughs> it don't matter what sign. It don't matter what sign he is, right? Sad. Have you ever had phone sex? Like just been on the phone with a girl and when I was in prison. Mm-hmm. Like when I came home, like that shit kind of weird to me. It's like, man, fuck the man. Where you at? Where you at? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fuck what you about FaceTime sex? I don't give a fuck. We can go to the trap. We can FaceTime. spot with him. Like we go to the back of a building. We get a problem. I like spontaneous <laughs> shit anyway. Mm-hmm. And, like every time, I'm not even gonna want to be in no bed. Like so, that's what the thing for me too. What about sexy FaceTime? A who? A sexy sexy on FaceTime. FaceTime. Like if I'm, it, like this, like if I'm, far if I'm away somewhere, from each you other. in LA, they all different say, like you in LA, I'm in Houston, I can't, ain't no way to right. touch you, and we rocking. Then hell yeah, call like her go ahead, crank that FaceTime up, up, sit that motherfucker up on the edge of your bed, <laughs> mm-hmm. still, you know what I mean? Post up in front of that guy and go AWOL, put that joystick down. <laughs> but, that so you jerk off on FaceTime? He took my heart. The girl, put the girl, put And what are you, what you doing? I'm just prime. I mean, if you want me to go up, it's him. You know, I'm just right there. Damn, but if you want me to go up, like, now, nah, whip that guy. Yeah, yeah, all right, yeah, say that. Yeah, 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 go up for a bitch. Yeah, yeah, but like, you're with it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Right. Listen, they're telling me you got to go, but I do want to say a couple of things. First of all, congratulations on everything. Congrats on buying your mama house. Yes. Yeah, mm-hmm. Which I think stuff like that That's is huge. amazing to yeah. see you yeah, do yeah, things like that. That was my whole thing. This shit, like, Mom do held me down so hard and like where she might know when I was guilty and so much shit that I was getting in, like she still going there, like, he ain't do that. 
Absolutely not my son. That was my nigga. So my whole thing was like, as soon as that shit get to run a little inner tour, in the world tour, I could do some shit for it. Like that's always gonna be first. Mm-hmm. If I that's even dope. do anything for myself, like I might not buy a bitch ass thing, but it's gonna always be more on dude than my family first. And congrats on the baby, because last time you were here, you yes, he it. was almost here. You know, I got a two p nugget. No, oh, you got wait. two kids. It's another hey, one. Yeah. Okay. I got a boy and a little girl. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, I feel so like wait. you said you thought one might have possibly been come yeah, out yeah, to yeah. the last episode. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She, uh, they, they wanted they, a possibly. They yeah. ghetto twin. They sit months apart. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, <laughs> oh okay, okay, that okay. is ghetto twin. <laughs> yeah, they ghetto twin. Okay, okay, okay. Are okay. the moms getting G-G along with each other? Like, no, that's why I was. Just, that's right? Yeah, I can relate. I'm a ghetto <laughs> twin. Totally different. Like, they don't get along. Yo, I ain't. I ain't gonna care. Like, and that, this the first time I'm ever you saying it. Only two of my homies even know this. Like. Bro, I ain't tight nigga like Leo with no regrets in history. I don't give a fuck whatever been done by then. I, I'm, I'm going to keep it G-code. I'm always straight on one way. So it's your life. I feel like you're supposed to go through shit like it is what it is. I ain't no success without no story. So I'm I'm cool with continuing to build my story mm-hmm. so until the big God called me home. But my 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 daughter mama is like, I regret that shit. Mm-hmm. Like, too bad on Lord. Like, I don't regret the child. Like, I love the little girl. Mm-hmm. It's like, feel me like, as soon as I look, I'm looking in her eyes and whenever I'm with it, it's like, hey, yeah, like, bad. You know what I mean? I fuck with it. It's real. But it's like, I regret going through with it for how it went. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And that shit was so crazy, too, because it wasn't even planned. Like, I was, like, me and my baby mom, my my, my son mom, we were locked in cop, like, just on some homie love type shit, just right. some thug love. That's when you had the fun baby shower, you was having a good time mm-hmm. with yeah, the family. Yeah, okay. facts, facts. And it was like, got down. So, why, when we started beefing and shit, that's when I started chopping up. Like, man, I been through my daughter mama. Mm-hmm. Like, and so, like, we just started chopping. She was actually engaged at the time, finna get married. And me and my son mom were beefing at the time. Mm-hmm. So when that shit was going on and we started chopping up, we actually ended up just linking, boom, boom, boom. We hit it out a couple of times and it just popped off our gate. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't got, like, I'm not against, like, for having abortion or none of that shit. Like, it's your body. You sh- you, you can do what the fuck you want to do with it. Right. Like, especially if you feel like you ain't ready for it or ain't the right time and then all that, boo. But if I want to come if you're going to ask me and be like, Troy, what you think? Like, um, I always tell you to keep it. Mm-hmm. Like, I ain't going to tell you to knock them off. Right. But like, if that's what you choose to do at the end of the day, then cool. So she ended up keeping them. Mm-hmm. Boom. But it shit just, I just got a different, that's why I always have my son so much. Like, I have my son like three, four days a week. It's just a lot like, of drama? They different, they different women. Mm-hmm. Like, I got a different respect for my, my son. Like, she she be hustle, she grind, she work. Mm-hmm. I mean, she just bought herself a house. Feel me? Like, so, like, anytime I give her some money, and I do this shit every month, she ain't had to put me on child support. Like I every week, mm-hmm. yeah, not every week, but every month, boom, drop a load off on her. When she bring me my son, he got new shit. Right. So it's like I can see like you doing you the right shit. She's you feel the me? Like even if it's extra shit, of course it's gonna be extra. Like mm-hmm. that you might be putting towards your bills or just going to have fun, but or whatever she has you do. A kid that's and cool. Right. The that, that's makes cool. The that's cool with me. As long as you're doing the right shit for my son. So it's like, but with with my daughter, that shit totally different. One time, like her one of her buddy, I ain't gonna say her name, but one of her buddy end up. Hit me out the blue and they like, Troy, you just went and gave that girl some money in the wood. I gave some. I was like, hey, yo, what's going on? Why you say that? How you even know that? She like, I know you did. She thought that bitch got down, dropped the, the dropped child little girl off on the home girl, and then got down with her, got her hair nailed, did with the Badger City. Wow. Oh, oh my God. That is crazy. Wow. I was like, like they crazy, but then at the same time, like, just lazy as fuck. Like, I ain't finna, I ain't trying to pressure her none of that shit. I ain't gonna get into a bunch of extra shit, but it's like, Basically, I just got a different respect for my son more than I. That's so crazy do you say that because we just had this argument on the Breakfast Club with the guys, and I was saying that men like women who are independent, and I think both people in a relationship should be able to take care of themselves, but know they could rely on each other too when necessary, and not that right. you have to, but I could still hold it down for myself. Mm-hmm. I don't. I'm not relying on you to take care of me. Right. And they were saying they don't think that you should be independent in a relationship, and when you're together. You don't have to be, but yeah, I'm like, nah, you should always, I think like, it's more attractive mm-hmm. when you fact, like when you handle your business. Like they're gonna make a nigga fuck. Like, well, speaking for me and a nigga like mm-hmm. me, like they're gonna make a nigga fuck with you harder. Like long as you pushing some type of issue, cause you don't never wanted to 
Like even whether it's your parents or somebody close to you or whatever, they come to you and be like, "So what she be doing?" Ooh. <laughs> right. Going to you feel me? Like you want to be able to say something, like no matter what it is, you, you don't want to just say, "Oh, she just be out here having fun." God damn, living in. You feel me? She just out here. I think guys want they want to believe that they want a girl who's independent and have their own and has her own things and takes care of herself. But an independent woman requires a lot more. Yeah. You know, we we have we 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 could get it all ourselves. So it's like, what do you what do you got for me? And then very busy. so it's harder to be with an independent woman. You, woman, you know what I mean? I mean, mean? Every, every nigga different though. Like some sure. nigga definitely not prepared for that. Cause because then like, a guy it come, like you would say with he a, wants it come an with an even bossier girl. attitude too. So it's right. like if you got them like all this shit that you throwing at a bit that you feel like I finna win her over like or the gang of trust and all that shit make her fuck with you harder. It's like if she can do that for herself. Then that shit spook a nigga off because it's like, what else do he bring to the table? Right. I know nigga like that. It's like, oh shit, what the hell am I got down to do with that goddamn shit? She can already buy that shit. Yeah. So it's like, right. all, right, all you coming in, all you coming with is some money then, you feel me? You ain't got nothing else to bring. So it's like, but but for a nigga who all the way company, you already got your own shit going and you know who you is and you know you can bring it on every other level. And it's like, hell no, nah, that's what you want. You want your big goddamn macho on her shit. How did yeah. your um son's mother react when you told her that you was having another baby since y'all was on the outs at for a little that while? That my little, that my little gangster. Of course, we have our beef even still to this day. Like we hit, <laughs> we have our arguments and shit. Like, but at the same time, that my nigga. Mm -hmm. Like, so we get over that shit and got down two, three days or whatever the fuck. No matter what the situation end up being, cause that's how it was before we even got into that. Like okay. we tried the relationship shit. Like when I was locked down after I got out of my second last, of my last from last lockdown. That when we got down, tried the relationship shit, I moved in and shit, but it, ain't, it, ain't, it, ain't, it just ain't work. Mm -hmm. But after that, we still stayed yeah, buddy. Still cool. You know what I mean? We just don't want to fuck around, none of that shit. Ain't one of those type situations. Like, I ain't going to never touch her again in history, mm -hmm. but yeah. that going to forever be my nigga and I got to cover. Well, I just want to say, if we had a male co-host on Lip Service, it would be trouble. Absolutely. So I just want to put that out there. <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> if you sure. ever was somebody that would be regularly on here, <laughs> we appreciate like you and happy for you, happy for everything that you've been successful doing. Love the yeah. music. Appreciate it, my dog. Not mad at the challenge. Y'all going to do the challenge? No. no. I'm going to help him pick a winner. <laughs> yeah, we'll the mm -hmm. we'll come out to the party. Yeah, yeah, I want to say, can we get an invite to the party? Man, can, lip, can the so ladies of lip service host we the party? Host we want to be deaf. judges. You can host that motherfucker. Y'all yes. be the judge. We I know y'all going to keep it gangster. And we still have to be so Come on, you know we got that low key challenge. You know we're going to keep it gangster. And we doing this in the bitty too. You know this shit finna be live while. And we always end the show with this. You got to guess which one of us did this, okay? Which one of the ladies, was it L'Oreal? Is it Stephanie? Is it Gigi? Or is it me, Angela? Went on vacation with our boyfriend's best friend. Friend. Oh, oh! You said went on vacation with your boyfriend, best friend. Mm -hmm. L'Oreal. Why well, uh -huh. gotta be me? I don't, it don't gotta be nothing. I'm just. I'm <laughs> we just gonna find out next time. You'll find, find out, out next week. Let's see if you had it right. Let's see if his intuition as a Scorpio is on point. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Chapo. Thank you so much. Love, as love. always, a pleasure. No doubt. I'm always called with my doubt. My name. <laughs> Lip service.